There's an enormous amount of support from the British government towards the development of new energy storage technologies. Energy storage is absolutely essential so that we can balance the UK power supply, particularly as we bring on new renewable resources. Thank you all very much for coming for the opening of the world's first grid-scale, grid-connected, liquid-air energy storage system. Clearly an important step for our company, but it's a really important step, we think, for the future of energy storage. The fact that this is about to go into service as an operating storage plant is a great testament to the team at Highview who have pushed this together with their partners and actually got to this stage. I would like to formally unveil the plaque and declare that this plant is now officially open and operating. To keep the supply constant and available, this type of storage is an absolute must. Even if we think that we're okay today, um, we're thinking sort of 5, 10, 20 years ahead. We need to be thinking now what we can replace our existing generation with. And with this, I shall officially start the plant. Ba-bang! There we go. I think we can all agree that today, the 5th of June, really was a key date in the life of this technology. It's the date when liquid air energy storage finally reached adulthood. Uh, to Gareth and the Highview team, and indeed to all of yourselves, I think we can all fairly say we made it happen. Thank you very much. So today was a really important part of the story because for the first time we saw at real industrial live scale a liquid air energy storage system being used, but it's being used for real. It gives us the possibility of taking a step forward towards the smarter energy systems into the next generation of energy technologies that very soon, I believe, will become normal on many of our systems.